All right, so we talked about the version of staggered um, or brick pattern like we're talking about with the tiles. There is half staggered and then there are third staggered. Now, some people even go as far as quarter staggered. I generally don't like that as much. No matter how it works out, it looks just a bit too busy for me. Now, that being said, you need to do what works best for you. I will show you the two that I generally use. So down here, we have our half staggered. Every other tile is halfway onto the one before it. And you'll see that the grout lines line up every second row. So it's boom, 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 all the way down, and your whole wall will look like that. A real simple design works really well, most people like that. Now, when you get into larger tiles, this particular third staggering works really well. On the smaller tiles, I wouldn't say quite as much, but you can see you have this step pattern, and then every third, so if you have another row here, tile lines up with the grout. So you can see how it changes. So if you look at this one, and then you look at that one, the best way to do it is to have it on the floor and to look at it, because just to talk about it and kind of you know think about it, you need to really see your tile in your situation to know which way works best for you. And that's the difference between a regular stagger, a half stagger, and a third stagger.